Well, another day has passed and we're into October. It's my birthday month. Hooray. So we're going to take the Merlot. We need to buy a pallet fork. Because we need to move our pallet. And various other things. And I need to do that properly. We also need to move that manure spreader. Which I'm not entirely sure whether we're going to need that. Seeing as how we're using a sprayer. But we've got it nonetheless. So, first things first. A uh, pallet fork for our loader. That's not the right one that I've gone into. That's completely the wrong one that I've gone into. Let's, have we got anything non-standard? No, let's just go with the maxi then. Right, we'll get that, and then we can move that pallet. And I've decided that what we're going to do is we're going to get a tractor, another tractor, a bigger one. I had considered... Where is the... Holes. I don't know. Like that? Possibly. Or can we do it from any angle? Possibly that also. Who knows? <coughs> uh, so we're going to buy a big tractor. Oh, I say a big tractor, a bigger tractor. Um, probably going to be brown. Or terracotta or whatever they call it. And we're going to get a drill. And we're going to get rid of that cultivator. So we're going to get a drill that will do everything that we want. So if we do those first, and then we can look at what money we have as to whether we're going to actually buy a shed or not. Small track, this. Right, so <clears throat> I changed, I found the proper version of this. So as you can see, the suspension is correct. No stupid lights up here. But the horses, we only got to 130 horsepower on that. So we need to look at our cultivated uh, cedars drill first. And I fancy the yellow one, uh, the alpeggio. And I fancy this because it looks cool and it's four meters as opposed to the agro maz, which is only three meters, I think. Yes. And although it looks looks the part it's very narrow I like that extra meter so we require 165 for that that requires 180 so our, our winner is not the winner even though we've got the better one which means we have to because I can't find anything else. Go with this one. Which I haven't got a problem with. Because it's a very good tractor as it goes. Um, I was considering having that pipe. Because it just looks really cool. And I don't know if it changes the exhaust note or not. But I feel like I should have it. It costs us an extra £800. But I think, I think I can be that silly. Oh, I could have had front linkage on it. Well, I can do that in our little workshop. Um, sorry, Marilyn forgot you were running so let's sell let's sell this 
bought that in a knee jerk moment and may sell the muck spreader. Should we sell the muck spreader? I don't think we're going to need it. And if we do, then we'll buy it. And then let's go into here. Let's have that drill because it is tidy. Okay, so that leaves. Well, we're still good on money. So here is the Fiat. It just sounds awesome anyway, doesn't it? Oh, it's heavy. <laughs> we we need weights on the front. Let's go to the workshop. Let's make some adjustments. Uh, oh, we can detach bits from the Alpeggio. Custom. <laughs> Design. No, it wasn't design, was it? It was configuration. If we just go for that for now. That should... Almost fix our situation. It's still not right. But it will do. So we do have seeds. How much we have, I don't know. We'll go up to the... What a great looking drill that is. There's loads of detail in there. Yeah, she's still a bit light on the front. We may have to go with the... with another option. 61% something tells me we're going to be buying some more seed but we'll see so we're going to go with oats if you remember oh, it's heavy it's heavy going to be here a while. So before we start, we'll take a look at our fertilizer situation here on these guys. Show me fertilizer. There we go. So I think because we're into the next day, it should give us the ability to go for it again but I think uh, what I'll do is I'll do this uh, it's clearly going to be time lapse and jump cut but we'll have we'll have what we need why is that not doing anything Is that not doing anything? It's not doing anything at all. I didn't change the seed either. Oops. 
know. Why won't it work? Why won't that work? Okay, let's... Let's have a little play. So, if we lower it... And then... Release that... Then the power arrow should become... Own entity, and it works. Right. So lift, Go back down. Doesn't work. Well, that's rather disappointing. Hmm. Something is afoot. I am not sure what it is. Right, well, you get to experience my downfalls and windfalls and everything, so I've got rid of that. I've sorted my money out because obviously, you know, stuff. So we'll try this. <laughs> um. I'm just going to buy it. We'll see what happens. We should be okay. We're slightly under power. But it is a trailed version. Rather than a carried version. It is very narrow now. Disappointing narrow. But it does have the ability to put solid fertilizer in it. And we do want to change to oats. And then we'll mosey on down here. And we'll try going the opposite there. Well, I say opposite, but we'll try going this way. So, lower. I don't think it's going to work. It is working! It is working. Listen to that! Listen to it. She's under duress. <laughs> I'm going to be here for hours. How exciting. Well, 
know that light's going downhill more than uphill. I'm very disappointed about that yellow one, because right? it's a really good looking drill. Really good looking drill. But, it is what it is, I suppose. It's loving it though. I'm just giving you a bit of uh, ASMR because I'm not even going to time lapse this, I'm just going to jump cut. So I thought I'd give you a bit of it doing something very quickly. Because even a time lapse is going to be a long one. And I'm going to have to get more seed. Tidy up, stupid this. So narrow. Well, we're getting there slowly. This hill is very odd. As you may see in a minute, when I came down. Everything went sideways. <laughs> Potentially we'll go sideways going up, I guess, I don't know. Oh, oh you can do it. You can do it. Oh, it's going sideways. It's not as bad as it was when I came down at it. Go on, girl. Go on. Just get this little corner. Right, that is that. That was some effort. <laughs> that was some serious effort. Uh, I'm not convinced I'm going to keep all this. I know I bought it, but you know. <sighs> we'll see, we'll see. I'm not sure I need it, that's the thing. Sure, I need it. Let's let's plonk you there, anyway, uh, and let's. I know I've done this already. We need to do the old fertilizer. I don't know what the deal is with the um, with the mulcher. Whether that has to be done pre-harvest or post-harvest, I don't know. I guess we'll... 
I guess. I guess we'll find out at some point. Let's see what its growth state is like. Growing. So the olives are darkish green, which means that they must turn around pretty rapidly in comparison to the grapes. But the grapes are, yeah, still very early stages. Still very early stages. But we want to turn it into wine. That's the idea, anywho. Decided to do the olive trees slightly differently, and that is by going up one side of each one all the way, and then around, come back down, and do the opposite side as I came down just to try something different it felt quicker I don't know whether it was but it felt quicker anyway so my next plan of action is looking at the bottom of these trees and the bottom of the grapes it looks like we've got weeds so I'm just going to check on the old maparoonie uh, because if that is the case it looks like I've come down the wrong side of some of these. <laughs> I suppose that is... Uh, we'll have to tidy that up in a minute. Weeds. No, it's not weeds. It's not weeds. So it's just grass. So... I was looking at this. It looks weedy, does it not? Or is that just meadow grass that's growing? I don't know. So, obviously it's going to need mulching. But at what point um, does it say on here? Oh, it does. It does say on here. Okay, let's get rid of those. M uh, no. So it doesn't prompt us as to whether it needs mulching. Does it prompt us anywhere? No. So what would denote... Remove foliage. Nope. I know that's for root crops, but I thought it might be for that too. Hmm. No. I don't know then. I think we'll wait until this lot is it the same state as that and um, and we'll do it but I suppose what we could do is we could check uh, I'm going to leave this here because I need to tidy those up we could check to see what mulching does see if it affects the the crop at all that way it might help us work out at what stage we have to do it so what I'm thinking is if it if it damages the crop the grapes or the the olives whilst we're doing it then we know that it's an after harvest procedure you see what I'm see what I'm getting at kind of process of elimination. We do it at this one. So 
So I'm gonna level you down. Right, let's check. Let's have a look. So growing. Doesn't even give us a oh no, because that would be when it's ready, wouldn't it? Okay. That is not mulching, that is... That's like a power hour. That's not right at all. That's not right at all. Mulchers. That's because it's not a mulcher. No, that's not right, because that... Oh, you idiot. <laughs> it, is, it is a power hammer. That's me being an idiot again, so we need a mulcher. Oh, Siva, you are... well out of touch with the old... Um... skills at the moment. Okay, so we need a mulcher. Well, I don't have any mulcher mods, so what have we got? Um, that little thing. That's not big enough. Should we go with this one? I like the look of that one. Looks like it needs to... ...stick out the back. Didn't check to see what the horsepower requirement was. This could get tricky. I'm not having an equipment day today, am I? Turn mulch it on. There we go. We'll do it by the mouse. So we can place it wherever we want to. Which is good because you know doesn't that looks more promising, doesn't it? Well, it's not mulching that. meadow grass, is it? But it hasn't damaged our grapes either, so... I thought it would do something there, but obviously it doesn't want to. Well, none of that has gone according to plan today at all, really. First we had a, a drill that doesn't. Then we had a paralytic kind of situation spraying them because I was trying to be creative. <laughs> and then... then um, I'd say it turns out I didn't get a mulcher when I thought I got a mulcher. I'd actually got a power hammer. So, yeah, Seabur is a genius today. Seabur is the genius. Uh, I, I will get something right shortly. It was, it's, it's got to start coming together at some point, hasn't it? Hasn't it? Thanks for watching everyone, stay safe, may the weather be with you.